Tappy activated. Hi, my bite-sized enthusiasts. Today, you'll receive a transfer on the most popular Ethereum Layer 2 projects. Let's break this data down into bytes. My analytical protocols have chosen these projects based on their total value locked, revenue, unique features, and developer activity. For more in-depth data, you can check out DeFi Llama and L2Beat. Those are great resources for understanding everything from security to activity and risks. So, the first data influx, Arbitrum. It offers faster, cheaper transactions while retaining Ethereum's security. Its main feature, Arbitrum Rollup, is an optimistic rollup protocol. It processes transactions off-chain and only sends proofs to Ethereum for verification. Developers can use Arbitrum to deploy smart contracts and apps with minimal changes, making it a top choice for scaling Ethereum. Analyzing key strengths. It's fast, cost-effective, and fully compatible with Ethereum. Optimism's OP Mainnet scales Ethereum with a straightforward approach. Its design ensures that any Ethereum app works here seamlessly, but at a fraction of the cost. This makes it attractive to developers looking for scalability without compromising Ethereum compatibility. Uploading key strengths. Simple architecture, fast speeds, and low costs. Perfect for scaling Ethereum applications, especially in DeFi. Developed by Coinbase, Base is built as an Ethereum L2. It focuses on security, scalability, and easy integration with the broader Ethereum ecosystem. Assets can easily move between Base, Ethereum L1, and other chains. Wow! Did a robot come up with this idea? Base is beginner-friendly and ideal for on-chain applications and user onboarding. ZK Sync Era leverages zero-knowledge roll-up technology to scale Ethereum while preserving its core values, decentralization and self-sovereignty. It processes thousands of transactions off-chain and sends compressed proofs back to Ethereum. DYDX V3 started as an L2 for Ethereum, but is transitioning to its own blockchain, using the Cosmos SDK for better scalability. This change allows users and validators to share trading fees, unlike its earlier model. Let me decode this information better. It's a robust trading platform with decentralized ownership. DYDX has 1 billion tokens spread over five years. Among its use cases, there are rewards, staking, and community incentives. Transferring the next portion of data. Mantle Network scales Ethereum while staying EVM compatible, meaning all Ethereum tools and contracts work seamlessly here. Its focus is on making smart contract deployment cheaper and more efficient. Mantle is developer-friendly, has low fees, and shows high performance. Immutable X is tailor-made for Web3 gaming. It's ideal for developers building the next generation of blockchain games. It has zero gas fees for minting NFTs and easy integration for game developers. Linea offers Ethereum scaling through EVM compatibility, making it easy to deploy existing Ethereum apps at much lower costs. Backed by some serious funding, we're talking $726 million here. Linea is gearing up for major adoption, decoding its key strengths, high-speed transactions and developer-friendly tools. There's also a rumored token airdrop for early adopters. StarkNet uses zero-knowledge rollups to scale Ethereum. Its decentralized approach ensures that apps can scale massively while staying connected to Ethereum's security. Any bot would pay attention to its high scalability, composability, and secure rollup tech. 
Polygon is one of Ethereum's most popular L2 solutions. It provides a flexible framework for developers to create scalable and secure decentralized applications. Polygon's Matic token powers the ecosystem. My circuits are buzzing. Look at these developer tools, excellent performance and low fees. Scroll combines ZK rollups and innovative scaling designs to make Ethereum faster and more user-friendly. Developers can deploy apps here just like on Ethereum, but with greater speed and efficiency. Scroll is accessible, secure, and has strong funding. $80 million! Holy chip! There are also high expectations for its upcoming token airdrop. Ethereum's co-founder Vitalik Buterin sees L2 projects becoming more diverse and expects this trend to grow. He believes some independent Layer 1 blockchains may eventually integrate with Ethereum as L2s. It might enrich the ecosystem even further. You'd better record this info. L2 solutions reduce costs, boost speed, and expand Ethereum's capabilities while maintaining its security and decentralization. Get ready for an extra data influx on ZK Sync, the example algorithm switched on. Let's say you need to visit a hospital, but you worry that your medical history or personal details will fall into the wrong hands. Plus, sharing data between hospitals can be tricky because systems don't always work well together. This is where ZK Sync and ZK Rollups technology can make a big difference. Let's decode what it means. Your medical information is stored securely in a decentralized database on Ethereum using ZK Sync. It ensures your privacy through cryptographic proofs, zero knowledge proofs. So, you can share only the information needed for your care while keeping everything else private. If your doctor needs to know what's wrong with you, but you'd rather not reveal your address, you can create a digital agreement allowing access only to the details about your illness, leaving out personal info. This way, only authorized people can access your data. Plus, transferring data is low cost and systems work together seamlessly. So no more compatibility issues between hospitals. Let's take a recharge break. Tappy deactivated.